Well, we hear that few persons stand out for the national protest in Florida state capital on Thursday as security operatives took over a major part of the metropolis. A few number who turned out led by, the, by Juan Buhari or Larry Wajo later gave reasons behind the low turnout, which the protesters attributed to panic already instilled in the minds of residents. Larry Wajo, who further noted that the new minimum wage is unacceptable, called on government to quickly address the security challenges in the country. I'm not disappointed. Uh, this is what I'm expecting before. Because, you know, the government has already created fears in the hearts of people. And it has already, you know, brought some, uh, some, some people to distance themselves from this protest. So this is expected. What we are facing in this country today is about hunger, insecurity, devaluation of NERA, and other things. So this doesn't call for, is it something, it's not a rocket science, is it something that government can do? If President Tunubu himself can be earning more than 50 million in a month, what stop a civil servant not to earn 10, 000, uh, 10 million in a month? We want 250,000 as a minimum wage for workers. An issue of uh, insecurity, you know, our people cannot go to farm to go and farm again. They are scared. So we want that to be addressed. And we want restructure in the judiciary system and in both in a uh, 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 security system. The day before yesterday, there was a show of force. We have a group chat of about 400 members on, on Instagram platform and, and on, TikTok, on uh, Twitter platform. We have about 10,000 engagement of Kuala State youth. That is not something to be underrated. A lot of them are still my, on my phone right now trying to get feedback from me if they are safe to come here. It's not that they don't want to come. It's not that they can't come. They can come, but they are not able to come because of the fear. All the residents bear their mind on the development. I wonder when I don't see people protest for their rights and, you know, to, to, to express their innermost feelings concerning the economic situation of the country. Well, I think our dialogue will solve the issue, or will solve the matter, because uh, if you see what happened in Kenya, our neighboring country there, the people came out, the, the citizens came out to protest, and uh, at the end of the, uh, uh, eventually, it resolved in, 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 in violence. Yeah, if he dialogue in a, in a in a good way is the best, then it should be done. Yes, it should be done because we all are governments. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.